about 1914, 1915, the town purchased the bell and built a cupola for the Oxford School. As we always said, it's, it's a national artifact. It's, you know, Paul Revere himself made this, and this is our town's history and treasure. You know, it ring on special occasions, like they would take it out of the building and ring it. Then they would put it away, and then they had no place to put it, so the town of Fairhaven school department bought it. The bell served as one to call kids to school, but also as a fire alarm system as well. If there was a fire in the town, they'd ring the bell and alert people. Today we're removing the bell from the Oxford School. First the cupola will be removed from the building and will be placed on the ground. Then they'll go up and they'll take the bell off and they'll hang the bell and people will be able to see the bell and you know, touch it and ring the bell if they want. This is a one-time thing. This is it. This is history. We're doing history right now. Because once it comes down off of this building, the bell will no longer ring on this building. Been sitting up in that tower quietly for 115 years to the year, so we're at the point where, because the school will be going, to bring it down and let the people see it and see their treasures firsthand. Well, from here, once it's done, we'll crate it up and it'll go into secure storage. And we have a bell committee that's been formed by the town, the Bell Committee of Fairhaven. And they, in turn, will get together and try to find some suitable future display for the bell. It'd be hard pressed to find anybody in town willing to want to sell such a national historic treasure. The bell will always ring. It will always ring, no matter what. Oh, the, the bell, without doubt, is going to stay in Fairhaven. That's a that's a town bell and that's not going to be going anywhere.